So he came home and he was like, you know, babe, I lost my job. I'm like, all right, cool. So a month later, like the bills, it was time for the bills or whatever, you know? And I'm like, you know, the bills do, babe, or whatever. And he was like, okay, you know, I'm not working. And and I'm just, in a month, like it's all kind of hustles. You could have been doing something. Now, lady, what did you just say when he lost his job? I'm like, all right, cool. Now, when you get a new job, typically you wait in two to three weeks to get that check and a lot of the times it don't even be a full check so for you to expect for him to be able to pay the entire bill after not having it first and foremost before he even got the job before he even got a check right don't it take money to make money so he wouldn't even have had he would have had to use and borrow money just to go to the job to make more money he would have had to borrow it from somewhere, somebody. So basically what I'm getting at is he probably would have been short. Probably wouldn't have been able to pay the whole bill. Like, I don't understand why you're not being realistic about the situation. It's just not real. What you're doing is not enough. Or whatever. So I told him, I said, look, if I pay these bills, are you going to pay me the money back? want you to know, I want you to know this is a selfish individual. This man had the nerve to tell me, why should I pay my wife back for, for paying our bills? I told this man from day one, my money is my money. So again, selfish. And his money is our money. <laughs> why should I spend my money paying the bills? So y'all don't be out on the street and give him time to go get another job so he can continue paying the bills. I'm not understanding. Like, no, he should have paid me back. So that's when I decided, like, I can't be with this man no more. So I had text his homeboy. Like, we all cool. I text his homeboy or whatever. You know, we went together. We, we got, we left. We, I met up with him. First of all, lady, why do you even have his homeboy's number? You disrespectful. You was already, this was premeditated. So what you were about to say next it's already some BS, fam, on God, because you're not loyal at all whatsoever. You was just looking for an excuse to text his quote-unquote homeboy. Stop it. And we was, you know, we was, chill, we was chilling, we were drinking or whatever, and I started venting. I started venting, you know, like I started getting emotional. One thing led to the next. I did not purposely mean to do what I did with his friend. Yes, you did. What y'all not finna do is some Jamie Foxx and blame it on the ah, 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 you know, ah, ah, ah. Stop it. Because what you doing is not enough. You need to take accountability for your actions. You meant to do what you did. You were already thinking about it because if you didn't, you wouldn't have his phone number in your phone, lady. Who you think ain't nobody, wasn't nobody born yesterday? But... Things happen. Things happen. Like, y'all understand what I'm going through. And we don't care what you're going through. We do not care what you're going through, lady. Because you made a vow, for better or worse. You said that in front of God. Not, not us. You know what I'm saying? We don't care about your narcissism. Is you serious right now? Is you for real right now, lady? Own up to you what you did. What you did was not ladylike, it was not feminine, and it was sneaky. You a liar, and you need to take accountability for your actions. What you're not going to do is try to play that manipulative role, get online, and try to play this, uh, uh, put on this sob story. Lady, we do not feel no sympathy for your actions. You understand what I'm saying? Lady, what you're going to get is what you deserve. The same way you got this man is the same way you finna lose this man because you was unfaithful and now he finna be unfaithful to you. That's karma. So, you know, his friend ended up giving me some money or whatever. And he was like, you know, babe, look, don't worry about it. Do handle whatever you got to handle. Like his friend was every single thing I desire in a man. Like everything I desire in a man. No, it was not. Your desire was to be captured by your temptation your desire was to be lustful that's what you, you listen fam if he was a real man he wouldn't have did the thing that he did with you to his friend fam you know what i'm saying 
Y'all got in that relationship on some disrespectful type of time and then you expect for this to flourish, I guarantee you that relationship is going to the ground. Because what you did was not in good faith. It was on some garbage, sneaky, nasty, like, come on, lady. Are you, is you serious right now? He was everything you wanted in a man? Come on now, you was on some some uh some sneaky link type of time lady you are too old to be trying to talk about some he was everything i wanted in a minute no lady his dollars was everything that you wanted you know what i'm saying you not this is another woman that is not loyal to anything but a dollar it, it, it's that's what it's looking like this is what it's giving us right now you see what i'm saying you giving us negative vibes lady no <laughs> Hey, men, do not trust a woman like this that's always popping their neck with braids in their head that's not real. Do not trust women like this. I'm going to put it to you just like that, dog. Most of these women on the Western Hemisphere are opportunists, bro. Get into a space where your woman can appreciate you, dog. And that's not on the Western Hemisphere, dog. On God. Leave them alone. Leave them to the side of the streets and leave them with the wolves. On my mama. And, you know, ain't nobody trying to hear my side. Ain't nobody trying to hear me out and what I went through. Like, it's, that's not okay. That's not cool. Lady, all you talked about was yourself the entire time. And your, and, your, and your problem was that he didn't have money. So you getting emotional over a dollar, not the relationship y'all had. You see what she values, dog? The dollar, not the relationship. The dollar, not the relationship. The dollar and not the relationship, fam. Take notes. Whenever a woman says you need to pay me back when y'all in a relationship, get rid of her. On God.